Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, I'm Sonia and I would love it if you could subscribe. And if you're not already an existing subscriber, welcome back. So for today's video, I'm going to be filming my update to the Throwback 30 project. So this is a Fantastic Ladies Club Facebook group project and it was created by Jessica. I'll make sure to have Jessica's channel link below and a link to the Fantastic Ladies Club Facebook group if you'd like to go over there and join. And this project is a combination of 30 different past and present Fantastic Ladies Club Facebook group projects, which everyone votes on in the group as to which ones they want to work on in this round. So this does finish in July, it goes from the 28th of July 2023 to the 28th of July 2024 and this update I can roll five items out. If I've missed anything I'll make sure to leave it below but without further ado let's just jump straight into it and I'll start with the ones I can roll out. So the first one is 450 shades of green and I brought in the Body Shop Shower Scrub in British Rose and my goal for this one was to finish it, which I did. I only introduced this one last update because the product I had in for 50 shades of green was affecting my skin. So I brought this one in. I've used it five times for a total of five uses and I am now able to roll it out. This was an okay body scrub. I'm not the biggest fan of this scent from the Body Shop, the British Rose scent, but it was something I used and is now done. The next project was for Happy Hour and I chose the Prompt Cheers, a product in glass packaging. And I brought in the Floral Street Arizona Bloom Perfume and my goal for this one was to use it 20 times. I used it the additional three times to get my 20 uses. It is empty now, however, this product isn't actually empty. Unfortunately, I don't know if you can see there but the actual top here broke. So I've had to get everything out of this bottle and decant it into a other atomizer that I bought. So there's still plenty of this product left. My goal wasn't to finish it anyway, it was just 20 uses, but that's the reason why this is empty. I absolutely love this perfume. It's one of my favorites. I absolutely, oh, I just love, love, love the scent of this and I will definitely get this again. The next one was I Heart the Nantes and I chose a bombed Buffy the Vampire Slayer that was a mythological creature themed item. So I brought in the Elf Skin Sun Touchable War Glow SPF and my goal was to finish this one. So I was here last update. So I really didn't have a lot left and I, as you can see, I have finished this. I've squeezed everything out of this I possibly could and my goal was to finish it. I used it 10 times this update for a total of 66 uses overall and it is now done. This is a nice SPF, I do like it. I do want to try the tinted version of my favourite one which is Ultra Sun to see what I think but if I maybe wasn't a big fan of that and I was after a tinted SPF I would definitely consider that. The next one is for the monochromatic project pan and I chose the prompt Feb and that was glitter slash shimmer. And I brought in the Charlotte Tilbury Collagen Lip Bath in Peachy Plump. And I have finished this now. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to see. I've scraped what I could out of this. I haven't taken the stop route, but hopefully you can see I have tried to get everything out of this. So I used it 22 times this update for a total of 116 uses and I'm happy to call this done. Wouldn't be something I would get again in my collection but because I had it I wanted to finish it and I have. Really 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 happy I was able to get this one done before the finale. And then last but no means least for the ones I can roll out I have Nightmare on Panning Street and I chose to prompt The Strangers, something that is no longer welcome in your collection. So I actually rolled in two Polar moisturisers and I already have finished one of them and I have now finished the second one. So as you can see I've tried to get everything out of this that I could. I used it an additional 11 times for a total of 51 uses for both of them. Was that for both of them? Yes, I think that was for both of them. So it took me 51 uses for both of them. The reason I wanted to move these out of my collection is I'm just not the biggest fan of Polar moisturisers. They're okay, but I've just never been wowed by them. So that is now rolled out and finished. And I don't think I've got any more Polar moisturisers in my collection or products, I think. Yeah, I don't think I've got even any more Polar products. 
So those are the five I can roll out. I'm really pleased that I've been able to get five rolled out. Now let's talk about the ones I have been working on. So the first one I've been working on is Child of the 80s and that, the prompt I chose was Like a Virgin, Madonna, a product you've never tried before. So prior to me putting this into this project, I'd never used this product in my collection. It was the NARS Laguna Bronzing Cream in Laguna 01. And my goal for this one was to use it 20 times and this is what it's looking like now. So it's definitely had some usage which I'm really pleased with. I've used it four times this update for a total of 19 uses. So I have one more use to go and I was going to wear makeup yesterday and today to try and get my uses but I, if I'm not feeling like putting makeup on I'm just... I'm not doing it like I'm not I'm not forcing myself to do it so I have one more use for this I will absolutely have this one done by next update the next one is drop 10 before summer so that was where you to bring in a product that reminds you of summer so I brought in the body shop Japanese cherry blossom strawberry kiss body cream and my goal for this one is to finish it and this is how much I have left now so I really don't have a lot left. Again, another one I will be able to have done by next update. I absolutely love the scent of this and I also love the formula of the body creams. These would definitely be something I would pick up again. I think I have a few more of these in my collection. Um, I don't know if you can buy this Japanese cherry blossom scent anymore. I've had this for a while, but yeah, I, I do really enjoy this and I used it 10 times this update for a total of 18 uses overall now with that one i seem to have lost my number so the 18 uses was just from the seventh update the next project is it's panning cats and dogs and i chose the prompt best of breed because i wanted to talk about maddie so maddie was our family cat and she passed away in 2022 but the prompt i chose for her was something black and white because she was white with black spots so for that i brought in the szechuan styling cream and my goal is to finish this one so this is where i'm at now so i was here last update and then now i'm down to here this potentially might be one that i think will stay in until the finale so I have used it seven times this update for a total of 24 uses overall i think looking at that i do think maybe it'll be like here next update and then i'll have a bit more to go but we will see if this is until the finale i'm fine with that i'm still not sure whether it's something i'll be able to finish but i'm definitely going to give it a go and then the last project i've been working on is that's expensive and that is where you to bring in like your most expensive product in your collection what you deem expensive is completely completely up to you and your collection so i brought in the kate somerville goat milk moisturizing cream now i have only just started to use this one this update because i was trying to focus on the polar moisturizers so i have used this one three times for a total of three uses and in the three uses i've used of this this is beautiful i I'm a big, big, big fan of this. I think I'm just a big fan of the Kate Somerville Goat Milk range because I really love the cleanser. I really like this. So this would actually be something I would get again, even just after three uses. I'm I'm not sure whether this is going to be something I'm going to have done by the finale because this is a 50 mil and I've got two months. So I don't know, potentially I may be able to get this one done, but I have only used it three times and I'm, I'm loving it that i do have one product in this project that i haven't started to use yet and to be honest i most probably won't use so i will talk about that when it comes to the finale in july but next update i think i should definitely be able to have two rolled out i should be able to have the body shop body cream rolled out and also the nars bronzer so i'll have an additional two and then i think i'll have a few going into the finale but i'm so pleased with how this project is going i'm not sure if this is coming back i really hope it is because i love this project but i am very behind on youtube so i'm not sure if there's been like any updates or anything about this project about whether it's coming back or not um but i absolutely love this project 
so i hope you enjoyed this if you did please do give it a thumbs up and it means the absolute world to me if you could subscribe if you don't already and until my next video thank you for coming by see you later